Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to episode 21 of Timber and Stone. So it's the morning of day 21. In the evening of day 20, at the end of the last episode, I built a second house. So my uh, blacksmith has a house, and now my stonemason has a house, both of which are pretty much identical, other than the fact somehow I managed to use the wrong bricks to build the walls of my stonemason's house. But at least it will remind me that he... Well, that is the house for the stonemason, I would imagine. So, <laughs> nothing really special to say about that, other than, oh well, whoops a daisy. Yeah, they're both in there, working away. Although my blacksmith's not doing anything at the moment. So is there anything for him to blacksmith? Not a great deal, because I'm doing much mining at the moment. I also started the process of clearing out the the flagstone road just because I've converted now to using the cobblestone inside my base, inside my walls. So I'm going to swap it all for uh, cobblestone. Although it's already being built, but why is my builder not building it? Why is my builder gone? Whoops, again, one, that was one click. Can I really not get any closer than that? Oh, we've got a stone, uh, stone archer. Brain's thinking one way. See, that let me zoom in halfway. It really doesn't make sense. Got ourselves a goblin archer. Is he just on the outskirts of. No, you're in range. Fire at him. Fire at him. Fire at him. Pretty sure I loaded up. Yeah, I'm on 1.1 still. I'm still stuck on the beta version 1.1 because 1.2 is the most unbelievably broken version of this game ever. Why are you not firing at this archer? <gasps> dun dun dun. Oh, you've been set to guard. That's preventing you from firing at anyone? Oh good, this is interesting. Please explain to me why you've not killed this archer. Because actually I think my woodchop is over here somewhere. I oh, know. Olivier is fine. Where are you? Oh, you're there. You're a trader. You're my builder, aren't you? That's why I'm not building anything. It's not really worth... What are you? You're my carpenter. Oh, we've got loads of feathers now for my um, herder doing his stuff. So let's make sure we keep on track of our... So we can do 12 of these. Five, ten. So that'll give us plenty for now. I'm gonna get too far ahead of myself. So what do we want to do in this episode? What do we want to have a look at? Ah, yes, I remember what I was doing. So you've just cleared out all of this. I was gonna build a little house for my herder down here. So let's keep you around. Because you are my level 20 miner. So let's give you... Where's the builder? Build the responsibilities and turn off Wait Hall and Heidel. It's going to need to give you a ladder. 47 torches? When did I build 47 torches? Why would I build 47 torches? Weird. Okie doke. So. 
let's build a little house for the hood for the herder. Um, going to want to make it out of brick. How big have I dug a hole out here? Ten by ten. That seems like a good idea. Nope, that's not right. Whew, that's close. I guess I probably should have made the house out of fieldstone to at least match. Wow, you really suck at building. Let's bring in our... Oh, a boar. Well, extra boar means extra hair, extra hair. So while my enemy's archer is just standing like a penis, we'll... and there's a chicken there as well. You're my superman. So I'm going to convert you from trader to builder pretty much immediately after I do this. You will, I'm sure, a, tra a trader will arrive, a merchant will arrive demanding, grr, demanding attention. Doing something. We're domesticating that dude. So bring him back. There's a hole always there. Good boy. Because you're done with that now. I'm using brick two, I think. to do is dig the floor down a little bit further. Where is my builder? I thought I brought him over here. Ew. Oh, I'm doing eight frames per second. I'm probably not seeing things. That's probably why. Oh, and we're transferring between late morning and midday, so it's lagging out. Need to fix slaughter then, that was a mistake. Do some herring. Congrats in breaking two hammers. Two steel hammers broken inside five blocks. No point or no benefit in using steel hammers. Now I've used two different bricks because I'm an idiot. You dig that out because you're my pro miner. You can continue to build the house. Um, 
What do I want my house to look like? I want to use fences for windows because there's still no glass. Fuck's sake, game. This 8 frames per second is a fucking joke. All being caused by that fucking goblin. Nothing's working. God. You please kill this fucking dickhead. He's just lagging out the whole game. Let's see if that restores any of the frame rate. No, it's still stuck at 8 frames per second. Because this guy's stuck in a weird glitch. Fortunately, my patience for timber and stone is currently very thin. Because all that's happened at the moment is it just, for some reason, has become the buggiest piece of shit ever. And it's not a very nice thing to say. And I don't like to uh, swear quite as openly, normally. But I just want to play. And it doesn't work anymore. And it causes me problems. I'm not sure what to do about it because I know it's a beta. I know it's still early release. I know there's still many things to be fixed and checked. But I just want to play Timber and Stone. Come on. Ooh. So I've already forgotten which brick I'm supposed to be using. And I've now got no frames per second. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing now. Here we go. How, you must be able to give me some more than 8 frames per second at this, this height. I've got two dudes in frame. Seriously? You are a one-hit wonder, aren't you, mate? Trying to work out if I can build the uh, the wall across the top, and then still mine the rest out of the way. Where are you going? There's nothing. There's nothing there for you to build. Why have you even done that? I did. The fuck was that game? Well, I have a feeling I'm going to cut this episode short now because it's clearly totally unplayable at this current situation. I have no idea why that particular goblin cannot A, be killed, and B, is just standing here lagging out my game. The only thing I can think to try and do is to use my forager to kick his little face in. So I'll end this episode by trying to kill this goblin. If it doesn't let me kill this goblin, then I have no idea what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to try and play it offline and work out how to kick his face in. Because I'm sure once he's dead, the frame rate will return.
Oh. So Philippe, my archer, can kill him. And frame rate returns. So that goblin was the cause of all my problems. Although, as my gatherist, you might as well gather some resources while you're out. And the game just happens to return to normal. So the archer's getting stuck on a road glitch is a bit of a problem at the moment. I guess I need to give you a ladder so you can get out. And I can decide on the roof in a minute. But I will call the video there, now that I've killed that goblin and returned the glitch to normal. Simply because I keep this one at 16 minutes. There's not much going on now for the rest of this episode. I'm just going to wait for my miner to finish digging out the floor. And then put cobblestone down. So this episode again, not particularly fantastic compared to maybe my previous episodes because there's not much going on. But when you get 8 frames per second, there is very little that you can do other than try and work out how to get rid of it. And the result of trying to get rid of it was not to get rid of it in the way I wanted to. But let the game somehow unglitch itself and somehow sort itself out. But we'll return very shortly with day 22, when some more fun and games will occur, no doubt, within the world of Timber and Stone. Now you don't have to wait for that exact block. You can you can build any of the other blocks, mate. I hope you've enjoyed, guys. Thanks for sticking around. Thanks for watching again, and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.